cloud. All right, well, all right, we'll see the cloud a little bit. Let's see if he's been in the lab. My man been playing some Final Fantasy. Fifteen? Seven. Seven. Yeah. Seven. Or Kingdom Hearts. Or Kingdom Hearts, yeah. If you want the edgy cloud. <laughs> the cloud that has a wing for some reason. Yeah. All right, both players charging something. All right. Nice catch to come down. Yeah, that's the scary thing about Daybreak's cloud. He gets going early on, and he racks up that percent like there's no tomorrow. Yeah. I know a lot of cloud players, like Ned, for example, they'll use the, they'll like, they'll spend the first, like, 30 seconds of the match just charging limit just so they can make use the speed buff or the movement buff, and then they yep. won't use, like, any of the limit kill moves, like, unless they need to, yep. like, for recovery. I say a lot. Oh, my God. Nice air dodge. Okay, he's gonna blast that. Yep. There we go. This is what Blade's been waiting for. Yeah. Off stage cloud is a cloud that you love. Oh my god. Good call with the down air there just to get Blade out of the way. Do you know what frame cloud's down air is? Quick? Yeah. It's frame quick. We'll go with that. I'm, I'm good with that. Now good to not air dodge there. Oh, air dodges. Oh, oh no. no. You heard it come out, but the blast zone was having none of it. Not today. <laughs> not in my house. Uh-oh. Gucci, I love you. Gucci out here causing trouble. That's what he's doing. Paying at a pub right Hello. Oh, look at you. You had this up? Oh, well, yeah. Curl got a know. hammer. Thank you. Cloud's down air is frame. Oh, it is frame. Oh, it's 11 and 13, not as quick as I thought it was. Wow. Hurts. But it's still got enough disjoint. It feels like it's frame four. Yeah. <laughs> the disjoint. Oh, I like the way he stopped the uh, cross slash there and just went for a jab. Yeah, I mean, sometimes you just want to create the opening. You don't necessarily need all the damage. Exactly. It's about getting, like, stage control and yep. seeing what you can get from yep. that. Because if you can, if you can gimp your opponent, it doesn't matter what percent yeah. they're at. Oh no, he dropped shield. Good call, just going high with that recovery. Yep. Oh my God, another one. Short hop airs are doing wonders for Daybreak. Grab some legs before he can get punished. Another crowd champ. Holy cow, two in one day. When he read that, that roll, I jumped a little bit. No options. Oh, he's gonna get. They're both gonna get back to stage. The nair is wow. gonna kill. All right. Daybreak shaking his head. All right. What's it gonna be? My guess is Falco. I, I really want to see the combo. I mean, he has been doing a good job against Sheiks with it. Yeah. Survival. Just back here, baby. Back here. Back here. Back here. Yeah. There he is. Hands off my prey. Yep. You're out of here. Uh oh, people leaving you, man. See you later, man. Three, Good to see you. Two, what? One, go! So here we go, going into game two on Town City. I really should have been like studying today. <laughs> yeah. Smash is priority. <laughs> you know. See you later. Yeah, these combos are a priority right now for play. Holy cow. Stomp the horizon, aka real me. Out of here. Oh, careful there. See you exploding over here. Chili dog Chad knocking the headphones right off my head. Hitting you with the crash bombs from behind. The crash bombs, man. Smasher says I shouldn't use that move, but I love it. It depends on the matchup. I killed Unknown at like 70 with a crash bomb back here. Exactly. Play a character how you want. Have fun. Yeah. The game's about to die anyways. Yeah. <laughs> crash bombs is going to be terrible in Ultimate. So is Leaf Shield. I love Leaf Shield, dude. I can get yeah. grabbed for free with that. Well, you ain't getting them for free anymore. Yeah, now I can, you literally Wait, can't do anything you, out of it now. Wait a minute, you wouldn't get grabs for free against me. Not against you. I just like, spam jab. Exactly. <laughs> I'd get a free 20% off of that. <laughs> if all four leaves hit you. Yep. <laughs> ah. Nice air dodge. Yeah, He's just standing there. Menacingly. Menacingly. 
He's walking! Oh, Back no. here! Walking is the most threatening move in this game. You can do anything out of a walk in this game. Exactly. Anything. It's Ooh. underrated. I mean, you, you can even do a walk out of a walk. Yeah, you can walk some more. Cardio OP. Back there? Almost killed. Up throw? Yep, but ah, not going to get it. Oh, frame trapped with the up air to back air. All right, let's Man. go. Habibis. <laughs> Got a nice little bit of percent. Want to get some more? Yep. If he, oh, yeah. that was actually a nice little trap there. Yeah. He did the back air, and if Blade teched, or teched and rolled in, he would have been caught by the up smash, or down smash, I mean. I don't know my direction. So is that? Oh, That's wow. it. Falco up air seems to be safe on shield. I love it. I'm learning new things every day. <laughs> crouches. There you go. Looking like Kirby. Blade Looking like a Kirby main. Blade remembered. He can just crouch. He doesn't have to approach <laughs> either. Nope. But he oh, does need the lead anyway. first. Yeah. Nice. Daybreak's really been doing good a good Lord. job once he's taking the lead. So I like the way that oh nice down smash. I like the way Daybreak is using the uh, what is it the Falco the bird illusion Falco illusion to yep. like close the gap really quickly. Yeah. Because he's putting Blade in like a, a, a I don't want to say awkward but like a, a, a strange position. Yeah. You know he's not quick enough to get a follow up from it, but he's like he has to pick a defensive option, his shield or spot dodge or something like that. Yeah, he keeps putting himself at that awkward distance where it's like. You have to yeah. pick something. It's not an easy spot to be in. Oh no! Nice up air. Not gonna kill. Oh, that back air. That'll Hello. definitely kill. And they said Falco's not a good character. Falco's alright. By the way, Gucci, congratulations on being a filthy John Lennon-looking mofo. <laughs> filthy John Lennon-looking king is what he is. Thank yeah. you. Ooh. -woo. <laughs> Ooh, ooh. Oh, whoa. oh, and you just lost us up. <laughs> <laughs> Later. Understandable. I'm really hungry. Oh my god. Hungry for that knowledge that you could have been studying. Yeah, I'm so excited to be taking. Oh, two missed calls. Okay. Probably gonna have to leave soon. Uh -oh. All right. Game three. Blade daybreak. Grabs right out of it. All right. Yep. What a king. Blade actually opted to go for Prevail here. Cannot blame him for that switch. Mm -hmm. So this is just going to be a back and forth battle between them switching characters, I think. <laughs> I unless, they, unless one of them is able to break that cycle and get the win before the other has a chance to switch. I got you. Right now it's looking pretty good for Daybreak, but he's going to want to SDI. SDI, King. Oh, good call going out there. Because a lot of people, when they're getting pushed towards the edge of the stage, will instinctively start to DI in. Yeah, it didn't look like he was SDIing that time at all. No. I mean, honestly, it's hard to consistently do that. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Nice that response. All right. Oh, no. Ooh. Don't go off stage. Oh, no. Ooh. Oh, he's listening. Oh, okay. They already got tech for days. He's fine. Tex. It's crazy because in the first game of him versus Nam, like there was something happening off stage and he didn't tech it. And I'm like, that was an easy tech. And now he's teching like a madman. Let's go. Yeah, he cleaned up his act because he was uh, getting charged with tech evasion. Nice. <laughs> Wasn't looking like a king. Nope. Not at all. SDI. Oh, he's Ooh. SDIing. Ah, oh, but he still dies. Okay. Yep. I see. I really just want to scream out Daybreak. SDI straight up. But that's coaching. I can't do that. Sorry, Gucci. Man. Why we can't have nice matchups? Why we can't have nice matchups? Also, why we can't have correct icons for the player names? <laughs> Rip. Cloud Bale. All right, this is a matchup everyone in the world has seen about 100 yep. million times, and they're going to Battlefield. So this is the fourth counter pick, because I'm counting the first one because it was a double blind. Yep. 
down smash. <laughs> hey, they're keeping you on your toes, Gucci. Keeping you on your toes. Here are those up airs. Three in a four, four in a row. What did I get yelled at for? Oh. They're oh, keeping you on your nice toes tech. with the uh, stock icons. I, I, that's what Mr. H just <laughs> came over and told me. Yeah. Whoops. That's what stops for too. Jeez. So the switch is definitely working out for a daybreak so far, but yeah. That can be all He's good, but SDI. one combo. SDI, bro. Oh my. He got down from that top platform quick. <laughs> Like he's trying to join the PGA right now. <laughs> I think an up air will kill Bayonetta right now. It'll be close, at the very least. SDI, come on, bro. Wow. Straight up. Just waggle the stick as much as possible. Oh my goodness. Oh That'll my do god. That okay. will do it. That's an angry swordsman. Swords. Oh boy. Now we'll go with Swordsman. We all got a little blonde Swordsman in us somewhere. Yep. Mine is actually great here. <laughs> Punish? Up air? Nice patience Wait. from Daybreak there. Yeah. I swear, Daybreak's really good at getting that burst damage with Cloud. Yeah. And his movement's looking clean. Yep. There. Oh, yeah. almost. Jumps right out. Yeah, that, close though. That platform definitely looks like it might have helped out too for Blade. Yeah. Back there. There we go. Give him a little bit of time to charge him. Ooh. Yeah, Blade's got, Blade's got to be a little bit more careful about pulling the trigger on these defensive options against Daybreak. Yeah. I agree. Oh, I thought Daybreak got grabbed there. No, Daybreak's one of the few clouds that actually remembers that the grab button exists. Down smash. Oh, scoops her right up. All right. But Good now, stuff, Daybreak. now this is the challenging part. Blade's got the counter pick advantage. So are we going to see it come full circle, go back to game one? That's going to be the question. Are we going to see Sheik Cloud to finish it off? Sheik Falco to finish it off on FD? Or Bale Falco? That's true. Daybreak does have the option to switch characters first. Yeah. And then Blade just reacts to it. Always thinking. You know, I think in this case he should stay with Cloud. In the last two games he was doing really well. The last game he was doing really well with Cloud. And, yeah. uh, you know, I think Blade Ding might have to... Oh! Um, okay. This is all something right. you don't see too often from Daybreak. This is the legendary hashtag Crackhead Diddy. <laughs> what? Let's go. The legend of Crackhead Diddy. Okay, what's the background behind this? I got to know. I don't know. <laughs> Diddy on crack, bro. <laughs> Can you imagine? Oh, my God. Fairs <laughs> all up. day. I mean, he is covered in white already. He is. <laughs> I, I really don't know what to say here. I mean, Daybreak's gonna really, really gonna want to avoid going off stage. Yeah. I mean, honestly, this was the last thing I was expecting for yeah. this set. I forgot he had a Diddy. Yep. He barely makes it back, yep. and now he's getting punished for it. Yep. Oh, good SDI there to finally get out of that. Jeez. The movement is clean for both players. Up yep. throw, up throw. Fair. And it looks like Daybreak's doing the, uh, the, like, I don't know how to describe it, but Diddy is one of the few characters that has, like, a smash type move with a special move. So, like, when you do, uh, the banana pull, if you, I think if you hold the B button, then, like, it, the banana shoots out higher than normal. Yeah. Yeah. You smash can choose the height of it. Banana pull or whatever. Oh, and that banana just sitting on the platform. Oh, smash. That'll do it. Okay. Nice lead. Diddy pick actually working out for Daybreak yeah. right now. Surprising. I'd like to see some more damage. Oh, there what you we go. Got? You want a damage. A little bit. It's going to have to be careful. This is day another though. So. Yeah. I mean, I don't. What do I say to this? Besides SDI, SDI bro. 
SDI, just SDI. Oh! Okay, you can't SDI that. Okay. That was clean. That was nice by y'all. Uh, just calling in that Madama Butterfly back up. Bayonetta players be like, I caught my madam telling me what to do. I don't know. I don't know about this game. Uh oh. Alright. Oh no, he's off stage! Don't go off stage. Oof. Be careful. Barrel's giving him a bit of leeway there. So now he's sort of playing Blade's game, where Blade is sort of oh. just dictating oh, this what's going to happen. Oh, that's going to be And it. you could just see it on Daybreak's face. Once he got clipped there, he knew it was over. Yeah. But it was a really good effort. That dude yeah. was looking clean. Yeah, surprisingly.